2K Sports and the Corn Ferry Tour are delighted to welcome you to today's event. Today's coverage of the Fellowship Open is about to start. I'm Luke Elvey alongside Rich Beam and Rich, no wins for this golfer, but they've been very consistent all season, keeping themselves inside that all important top 25. Absolutely, they've been solid all year long and it doesn't look like we will see them on the Corn Ferry Tour next year just because they should progress to the PGA Tour next year. No doubts about it in my mind. This is an exciting one, Rich. Let's get into the action. Out of boy, good shot. And Henny, what's he facing with this one? Setting up here from about 150 yards. <laughs> Choosing the nine iron here. This is from miles away. That's disappointing. Oh, I don't mind this par putt. Starting the round at even par. Very nice par indeed. Very solid hole play. He finds himself in a share of eighth. Now with the honour on a par five. That's a good looking shot there. Second shot on the second. Not a bad approach, that one, up onto the green. A couple of putts from there, and that'll be a pretty good hole. And he's down there. You got a read? This one will run uphill. Just didn't drop. Almost snatched the eagle there. That would have been huge. Currently one under for the tournament. Now on the tee, fresh off a birdie, a great opportunity to build on that momentum. That was a great shot at the right time. That would be back-to-back -back birdies for this player. And as the school card suggests, heading up the leaderboard. Here we are at the fourth hole.
Yep, that'll work. That's fine. And this putt is for birdie three on the scorecard. Oh, so close. Didn't quite have the right stuff there. Just three feet to go to the hole. Don't miss this. They can be costly. Our leader is a couple of shots up at this stage. Time to step on your tee shot here at this long par four. This looks to be a fairway seeker to me. Playing from around 150 yards here. He's two shots back. Opting for the 9-iron. Nine -nine. Well, this one's going right at the flag. Terrific approach and a chance for a birdie here on the fifth. And they'll tap this in for birdie. Just two shots back after that hole. Here we are at the sixth hole. Oh, absolutely flushed. This needs to go a little bit right once it lands. This is one of those great ball striking displays, fairways and greens. A pleasure to watch. Well, the practice is paying off here, Luke. This player is relentless. Oh, that was such a good stroke. You can mark it down. That's birdie number four today. And that will take him to four under. He's currently sitting in second. Deep into the front nine. Here we are at the seventh hole. This player's got some lovely momentum coming off a birdie at the last. What a drive. Look at that. And he's down there. Setting up here from about 155. And choosing the eight iron here. And he's safely on the green. A chance to move to five under par. This one's looking good. Yeah, you like the look of that right off the blade. And right to the top of the leaderboard after that effort. 
leading by a couple after that hole. We've reached the eighth hole. See that one just drip back on the flag. Well played, mate. Lining up the birdie putt here. Steady now. Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hole. Just four feet remaining between him and the hole. Oh, that's a clutch par. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Teeing off now on the ninth hole. <laughs> Looks like they put a good swing on that one. That should find the short stuff. Well, Rich, this is quite an interesting vibe, isn't it? Usually we're here for the Players' Championship and that's uh, millions of people are watching around the world and thousands at the stadium course. But these players on the Corn Ferry Tour are sort of getting a, a glimpse of what life on the big stage might be like. Well, I tell you what, I can promise you the pressure coming down the home stretch playing 16, 17 and 18 trying to win this tournament. It's going to feel just like it does at the Players' Championship. These holes don't get any harder or any easier with or without the fans. It's going to be exciting to watch. And here we are with the third shot. Currently leading by two. Four feet to the cup. Yeah, nice mid-range birdie putt, that one. And that will move him to six under par. Lovely position for our leader here, Rich. Out in front, but a few holes to go. Yeah, but I, I like the position. I like being out in front. It forces the other players to come catch you. I like their position. Wonderfully played. Do you like the view from where you're standing, Henny? And from around 135 yards. Well, it 
looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. He's found the surface. Good chance here. This one here, this is for back-to-back -back birdies, moving him in the right direction. What's in front of them, Henny? Setting up this putt 19 feet from the cup. All right, guys, this for two birdies in a row. The putt drops, and that's back-to-back -back birdies. Back-to-back -back birdies never hurt, Rich. Kind of like it. He's feeling it. No movement up or down on the leaderboard for this player. Love the long holes. Welcome to the par five. This one might just sneak off the fairway. Time for the second shot at the 11th. And this player is really going after it here, Rich. I'll tell you what, what a sensational play. This player stepped up their game, a bold play, hopefully a bold reward. by the hole yeah that looked to be a bit of a misread this putt coming up is for birdie our current leader is up by three shots now teeing off on the 12th hole That's a pretty handy shot. That was a beauty. Luke, nothing gets past you. Yes, this kid is a stud. Oh, that's frustrating. Putting for par. Sitting at minus eight for the day. Now it's time to take a look at this 13th hole. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. This one looks just a fraction too long to me. 
That was wonderfully done. Well, this will be a big putt to make. The birdie always nice, but particularly when it's a two. Oh, just missed. No, oh, that's too bad. Pretty straightforward four-footer coming up here. This is what they have left for a part. That gets the job done. Leading by four strokes after that one. It's time to begin this powerful hole. Well, that's a handy shot. And Henny, what's he looking at here? This whole location for him, well, it's about 185 yards out. Looks to be going with the five iron. This one looks like it'll safely make the green. Yeah, a quality shot, that. Trying to get to nine under for the event with this opportunity. Ouch, that hurts. This part of about seven feet to the hole. This one started out on a good line. Well done. Still in the lead now after that hole. Welcome to the T of a par four. Oh, that's a tad disappointing finding the branches there. Pretty good shot there. Time for the second shot at the 15. No harm, no foul there with that shot. OK, Henny, what's he looking at with this putt? Setting up this putt 23 feet from the cup. That was a gallant attempt. That'll sting a bit. An opportunity to make a par here. And the putt drops now at eight under, heading down the stretch. And yeah, nice to have that cushion heading down the last few holes. Our leader is currently enjoying a four-stroke advantage. Three holes remaining, Luke. This is getting awfully fun. Lovely effort, that. Second shot here. 
on the 16th. Oh, that's outstanding. Another great shot by our leader. Always like the aggressive play, going for it in two and getting rewarded for it. This putt to get to 10 under par. That line was looking good, wasn't it? A birdie putter waits. And now that finds him in first place. Two holes to go, Luke. Can they hang on? Let's find out. We have a par three on this one. Nice birdie at the last. Let's see what they can produce here. Not a bad approach, that one. Not quite inside the birdie range, but you never know. Hull a long one. Still counts. And this one for back-to-back -back birdies. have the right stuff there sometimes when you try and get it up the hill you just forget to hit it sometimes it seems so in this case currently not under for the round and now this player tees off their final hole of the event with the lead This one looks to be heading down the runway. Oh, he's been putting on a clinic all day. Another beauty by our leader. That drive was simply astonishing. Looks to be going with the six iron. A wonderful shot into the 18th and a chance for birdie. Gotta like their chances from there. And he can win the event here if he can hold this part. Oh, super effort that. Holds the putt to win it all. Fantastic week, Luke. A well-deserved win. This player was on top of their game the entire week. Congratulations. On behalf of Rich Beam and all the hard-working folks at 2K Sports, I'm Luke Elvey. Thanks for joining us. See you next time.